Well, welcome back, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for taking the time to spend a little time with me. I always appreciate that. In this particular video, guys, I got some feedback that I want to provide here, man. Some constructive criticism, the areas that I would like to see uh, the Madden team work on during this cycle because overall Madden 23 is a much improved game in my opinion some may not feel that way but hey that's my opinion of it and I'm gonna stick to that but it is not perfect you know it's far from perfect it definitely still has a ways to go in terms of you know even more clean gameplay you know some people are saying it's some of the the cleanest gameplay they've had but yes there's still some areas of concern um, now the way this play finished was pretty good you know physics caused this particular fumble Janard Avery here you know I was able to get the pass rush with him his shoulder hit the ball and it popped out that is a wonderful thing to see even with the fumbles turned up I have the fumbles up to 70 because I just felt like there are way too many fumbles being caused by hit sticks so I turned that up so it doesn't happen unrealistically and you still see fumbles happen due to physics which is how it should be but we're going to focus on a couple things, man, to give some feedback on what I think needs to be cleaned up. Like right here, you know, there's an emphasis this year that, you know, defenders can only play what they see. And I appreciate that. This is cover three cloud. And it looks like maybe Cam Sutton is anticipating this guy going long. However, you know, it looks like he's already looking back. So why can he not see that the receiver isn't there anymore? OK, now this doesn't happen that often, but this is a situation right here where it does so they have to get the head tracking and ai and awareness you know keep that intact or improve that because again it just looks funny having cam sutton do that now maybe if you had cam sutton not looking that way maybe i believe it but the fact that he's always looking to he's already looking to his right should have been able to tell the receiver was no longer there uh, right there you're just seeing who i was user controlling so you can kind of understand that that's not CPU defense there as far as uh, Mark Robinson there, number 93. Everyone else, of course, is CPU controlled. Let's look at the pass rush here by De DeMarvin Leal. Um, you know, there is more animation happening here, but you see right there how that animation started. I definitely want them to get to a point where edge rushers, if they rush outside, they continue on that path. Like, look at this. Keep going outside. Like, why do you go right into the block? So that's something else to continue to work on because sometimes you'll see it that that interaction doesn't happen like that. It does look a lot smoother. But in other cases, you see where they're still pulled into that interaction, even though he's able to get off of it relatively quick. They still pulled him into that interaction instead of allowing him to continue to rush towards the outside shoulder of the tackle. Now, on this side, you see a cleaner interaction. Uh, Jannard Avery is going to go to the left. And even though the animation started there, you still, his, his angle still looked more, you know, consistent as far as what you would expect it to be with him taking an outside rush. But then the AI falls. You know, it fails with number 67 there, how he doesn't continue to pursue Avery when he's on the ground. You know, he just turns his back on him, and Avery is the one who ends up making his play. As you can see right there, physics induced, you know, fumble there but look again look at the tackle look 67 he turns his back and he i mean i guess he's going to look for more work but in reality he should make sure that his guy is out of the play look he turns away from him there so little things like that they still got to work on hopefully that's something that they can improve during this cycle because this would be a pretty good game if they can get that together all right guys hit that like button subscribe to the channel Turn your you know I can't talk. Turn on your notifications. Catch you in the next one. Peace.